Hey folks, I'm Surveying Glory, and welcome to part 101 of my playthrough as Marmorus in Crusader Kings 2. See, Marmorus, we are actually the Emperor of Carpathia. Not bad for somebody who's aiming just to try and survive for 400 years. Um, so yeah, we are the Emperor, and we're looking to ever expand. This is interesting to me just now. This is my heir. And also my uh, my son, yes, of course I knew that. Um, he's decided to push into Odessa, which I'd planned to do myself, but I'm happy for him to take that on. And he's a reasonably intelligent character. He's a genius. Um, but he's got himself into three wars at the same time. So, uh, Croatia, the can can raise 10,500 men. So I think I'm going to offer to join that war and help him make sure that he completes that, get that wee bit of expansion. And then I'm going to see if I can not expand into here and start nibbling this part of Croatia. We've got our Chancellor down here trying to get his acclaim, but this has been going for a while. A number of Chancellors and not getting anywhere. So yeah, if we can take this. And then see if we can not get some sort of, maybe a border dispute or some sort of holy war uh, to help me take some of these provinces. And that would be ideal. And we also have, uh, we can create the Duchy of Montania. Which is where? I'm not seeing that. Let's see de jour. There I'll see it now. Okay. Um, how much does it cost? 100 gold? Let's do that. Gives us another claim. And the other wall that's going on here uh, is for this county. Yeah, so he's trying to revoke this county from the Prince Bishop. So let's go ahead then. Um, just start the retinue moving, but We'll offer to join the war uh, to claim Odessa. And we'll get our troops raised and march to here. I gathered my followers and my hunting dogs. I've saddled my horse and prepared my weapons. I'm ready to decide out to hunt the great white bear. And this is going to be the last time I'm going to try this. I'm going to change my focus soon. Uh, oh yes, and I have invited some people to court to become commanders. Just in time for this war. So, let's get these guys appointed. And once we have got our forces together, you accept, that's good. Um, we'll assign those commanders. I've encountered neophyte Etienne many times while carrying out my duties for the Hermetic Society, and it is always a pleasant occasion. Um, okay, fine. Uh, let's think this is friendship. I spend many weeks in the wilderness searching for any trace of my prey, but to no avail. I find plenty of bugs, snakes, and riding sores, however. Chance of becoming stressed. In case that siege has gone down, let's get ourselves across here and group these guys up. And as I said, let's get the right people in charge. Three specialisation forest and hills, and we're going to step. Do I have anyone with step? I think so. But we did bring in some good folks. I, I presume you guys are Catholic, yeah. So we can't, there's no point having Holy, holy Warrior. But we do have this guy, we have the Tiger and we have the Dragon. So let's put you in charge there, and I'm going to uh, switch around some of these units as well once we get everyone together. 
But do I have any flankers? Apparently not. Um, I think I've still got a space actually for a commander. Uh, so let's see. I don't have any flankers here either. Okay, um, something I've not done in a while is look to kill, um, not kill, uh, but look to have uh, opponents unfortunately die while in command. Oh, it doesn't really bother me at all, so let's not bother with that. I don't want to put, my minus 3%, no I don't want to put you in charge. Let's just have you. That'll do. And so how about pursuit then? Ah, there we've got a step commander. No, uh, sorry. Uh, Henri, where are you? Where'd you go? You can lead the center. Uh, we have the dragon guy. Okay, he can go there. And... Narrow flank. Do you can go in there? Okay, I won't give up yet. Yes, I will actually. Uh, so I said I was going to change focus. Let's change to uh, diplomacy. I think. Like I'm getting on a bit. Let's go for health. And did I get stressed? I didn't. That's good. My heir is, and as a member of the Hermetic Society, uh, I can, I can do a thing. What is the thing? I thought I could, I thought, is it? There's at least two ingredients. I need ingredients to do this. Okay. Um, right, so we need to wait. Next time we get an offer, we do go and gather ingredients. Okay, as the farmers prepare for sowing their spring crops, my court chaplain suggests that you bring out the holy relic in procession and bless the fields. Uh, yeah, let's do that. That's not all Croatians, thankfully. We could have taken them anyway, I'm sure. Right, so let's see, what do we have? You're in the centre, you're in the flank. Keep you in the flank for now. You're in the centre. Okay. Two and a half thousand in the flanks. I don't know about that. I think I would rather have these guys out in the flank. Yep, that'll do there. And I suppose I could move you across here. And maybe draw back in them. Okay, we'll go with that. Now let's get you up here. And a siege. Uh, I'm not going to assault, we'll just uh, let it go. It should zoom through that quite quickly. A matrilineal marriage. Uh, this guy... Okay, so he's not one of our commanders or anything. No reason not to let him go off. Uh, 
There we go. So we're at 74% here already. We've got potentially about 1,500, oh no, 1,500, 10,500 men. That Australian army's got nothing to do with it. Um, so let's march in here. And we finally get that claim. I don't want to go that far into debt though, so let it go. And continue your good work. Where is the Croatian capital though? Is it down here? Yes. Never mind, we'll just siege down what we have. I don't know about that kingdom. I'm not, well, I might create that at some point. We've lost a commander. I think um, my nephew, yeah, let's just make you the commander. And he's he's up that county. So who's this? Just a host. Ah, these guys popped in when I was otherwise occupied. Let's get his speed turned down a bit. And we've lost another commander. And our spy master. Okay, let's invite some folk in. Again. Infantry leader and direct leader alike. This guy's an, an organizer as well. Hmm. I think we'll go with the heavy troop leader though. So you come to court, please. And yeah, let's have you here as well. Well, let's have a Catholic guy. Okay. Hopefully we're going to win this. Uh, yeah, we've already broken the center. So should be good there. And you are the spymaster, I believe. Yes. Uh, point counselor, spymaster. And you get to be a commander. Good. 75 war score. That's a bit fantastic, isn't it? Uh, seriously? Okay. Um, go ahead and make your peace then. We'll stay here and continue to siege down. That's where we can. Maybe make a bit of cash. Route needs a new ship, 200 gold, okay. And there we go, we get home 15 gold. I suppose uh, because I'm now the world leader, I can offer peace and force demands. Odessa is ours. You can back into here and you can stand down. Well, actually, just come back down here, smash this host. I want to arrange a marriage. Who are you? King of Austrasia. You are my... You're a kinsman, I think. Austrasia. And... 
Yeah, okay, fine. I'm happy enough with that. Don't know who she is. Okay. And done. Today I was approached by my son Vlad the Twelfth. Apparently he is concerned about my health and thinks that I am becoming too frail and thin. If I keep eating so little, he says, I will soon no longer be able to wield a sword, pleasure a woman, or even just go out riding. Um, why does he care, actually? Plus one health here. So I should hopefully be okay. But, yeah, why does he care that I live? I suppose he just loves me. That's bottom line. He doesn't, actually. Even though he's my rival, he still only dislikes me 31. And he's ambitious. Anyway, so, yeah. I think I want to continue on the throne for a while longer if I can. Even if I can get immortality, that would be fantastic. Maybe I should eat a bit more. Emperor Vlad gains th stress, 30% chance. Let's do a bit more eating then. Maybe he's trying to get me to die through piggery. These guys can now stand down. Should be safe enough to do that. And you follow them in there. And wipe them out. Didn't actually manage to wipe them out. So keep following them. Uh, this is just some dude. Well, actually... Uh, what am I looking for? Somebody at court called Aaron. Yes, it was him. Grey Eminence. Yeah, whatever. Vlad XII's advice was really the motivation that I needed to get back in shape. It was hard to adjust myself to a different diet at first, but now I am feeling much better, ready to take on whatever challenges the world might throw at me. Fantastic. Okay. I wish I'd kept 11,000 men. We might have been able to just wipe these guys out. But, do the old dance. Uh, captured somebody. Perfect. Unlikely to be able to get any money for them. Okay, I've got about 185 every time. Where are you off to now? Uh, Grin there, you'll arrive on the... You can get there, oh, you can get there directly, yes. Uh, you live there on the 5th. We're in here on the 21st, so we'll catch you and kill you. Some more. Captured somebody else. And... Yep. So hopefully this will see an end to it. Get rid of some of these prisoners. Henri, who are you? All right, it's the bottom of the Swiss company. We can't ransom you anyway. We can't ransom anybody. Fine. And there we go. Done and done. So you get back up there. Uh, rest up a bit. In fact, just stay here for now. I'm going to kill these raiders. Life's never dull. In here. I keep looking at this guy, or this county, but the Caliph can raise 35,500 men. So, that's a no-go. You... Ah, you can raise 4,000. The holdings in the county of Bacau are all du jour vassals of me. Okay, so this dude would come in. He can raise 8,000. Hmm. 
Hmm. I think we just go ahead and do that then. So you actually march to yeah, go and kill them, and then march to there. And let's have a look, see what my son and I think nephew are up to. And yeah, okay, uh, fine with that. Is my son? He doesn't have a male heir. It's not a problem. It's just the disappointment when we've got a genius that's not producing any sort of genius kids. Third time lucky, maybe. So he's only twenty-seven, but and she is pregnant. Oh, no, she's going through a difficult. She has, she has, yeah, she is pregnant, but she's also a lunatic with cancer. Mild treatment, but that's not so bad. When she dies, you can remarry and get you a genius wife. Okay. Right. Yeah, as I said, you head back over there. And I wanted to check out what was happening. No real threats. Uh, Kill, 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 kill. You're looking to kill me. You just told me to go on a diet or to eat more. Stop backing plot or I will murder you. Thank you. And you. End your plot. No. Okay. So. Just make sure, no, I don't lead armies. In fact, I don't want... Ah, I can't do that just now, anyway. Um, what? Oh, yes. Spymaster, I don't think I've sent you to do anything anyway, so that's fine. Yeah, so, we'll just leave you in Marmorous. That should help keep me a bit safer. And get a move on. I think I'm building, I'm proving the well, main settlements at the moment as it is. Yeah, we've got riding grounds going up in there and barracks in there. Good to see they're upgrading as well. Court, that's the highest it can go until we get cities and temples. How about you? Now you've got church town, you've got court. Okay, so you've maxed that out. You arrive there on the 16th. So let's. Declare our war. And that can come in, that's fine. So I'll do that and get the rest of the guys up. March down here. There we go. So seize that. I don't have enough men to siege it down. Never mind. During the last few days, my son has not been able to keep any drink or food down. It seems as if he is suffering from food poisoning. Call for my court physician. One can't have that. Hmm. We cannot have him die. And he now has a genius son. Fantastic. Let's... Assign you a fantastic guardian. No, it's not me. That's me. 
No, it's not. This is dad. It's my son. Where am I? There I am. No, that's not me either. What are these family lookalikes? Uh, there we go. Vlad, Emperor of Carpathia. That's fine. I'm controlling who you marry. I can't control your focus though. But, never mind. If your dad dies, at least I know you're coming up to take his place. Let's have you... Yeah, take that route. We'll go and stand on that siege as well. Uh, good, I'm glad you accept my guardianship of your son. Ah, so my daughter marrying the King of Italy. No. But that's fine. I did want to try and improve relations with Italy again, such as they are. You never know, they might come back into greatness. I just accepted that, did I not? There we go, form an alliance. Let's get that done. And change my mind. You come back in here first. Just the other day, Skullcrans often do. Yep, flesh is weak, forgive and forget. We have an alliance. And why not put it to use? Come and help. That'll be good fun. You're in the 22nd. Uh, you're in the, f uh, the 5th of May. Right, well, in that case, let's stop you there. It's not going to stop them. So I'll get you across there then. Who are you? Nitria. No, Peresian. Uh, yeah, okay. That's good. Vision of Bulgaria. Request that King Lars Ramadan Vision of Bulgaria. Ah, so they're invading us. Let's send that as well. Dear Vlad, I am a bit concerned about this war that you currently struggle with, and therefore I decided I would send you a small gift. Oh, it's very small. Thank you. Okay. Well, I'm going to put in a break here, and when we come back, where did that army go? It was them. So there's not a war there anyway. Uh, yeah, let's get going. You turn and smash them. 500 light infantry, 800 heavy, 280 light cav, 250 archers. So I've got a lot more heavy infantry, pikemen, a lot more, well, light cav, 600 odd, they've got 290, yep, 271 archers. Yeah, okay, so we should be able to take them. You've even got a commander. Heavy foot, extra damage, good. Yes, so I'm going to put in a break. When we come back, we will hopefully conclude both of these wars and expand that wee bit further. I'm just thinking though. Uh, yeah, this invasion of Bulgaria. At least we don't have any other people in here. I was worried that you might be calling in. You don't need to call in, you've got 33,000 anyway. Need to save up some cash, maybe, but bring in some mercs. But we've got Italy riding to the rescue. Okay, anyway, I'm going to put in a break. Thanks for watching. Please leave me a comment, rate the video, and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content. And I hope to see you again next time. Cheers.